This is a level up guide for Spectre. I know you guys want those OP weapons that requires level five. So let's jump into it. But real quick, I'm going to give you guys the level requirements and then we'll go into details. Before we get started, I want to give you guys some intel on how much money it's going to take to level up and XP. Level two, to start, you need to aim for 25K XP and you need to spend or sell items a total of 125K. Level three, next you need to reach 75K and then spend or sell worth 400K to get there. Now I'm progressing through level four by hitting 150k xp then focus on spending and selling a total of one mil and then the last tier is level five you need to gather 325k xp and then spend or sell two mil 500k to hit level five there are different ways you can go with leveling up specter i'm going to give you those options you either can go assault rifle route it's slow paced but it still gets the job done killing 15 felixes with the assault rifle will give you 12 XP money you'll get 1500 kill 25 players you'll get 6300 money you'll get 3700 killing five players without dying three times you'll get 4800 and then money you'll get 1300 kill 15 players in five raids you'll get 18,000 XP and then 5100 for money Kill 10 players with the assault rifle, you'll get 2,500. Money, you'll get 1,500. Now let's talk about the fast way you can level up Spectre. So with the new recent update for Maka and Underground Maka, Felixes are popping up every 30 seconds to a minute. This is big for us because we can farm these guys in one raid. So before I give you the missions that you need to toggle, let me give you some gun options you can use during your level up phases. It has to be a SMG, but let's go ahead and get started with level one recommendations. Level one, we got the Mac 49, the MP40, and the Mac 11 Gold for level one. Level two, we're gonna do the CX Storm. This thing is a beast. Level three, the John Wick uh, MPX. I literally just use this all the way to level five. This is gonna be the best gun during your level of phase. And then level four for you guys that don't have the DLC is the vector, either the 10 millimeter or the nine millimeter. Now that I gave you the best guns during your level up phase, let's go with the quests you wanna to toggle before you go into your raids. Kill 15 Felixes with the SMGs will give you 1200 XP and 1500 money. Kill 25 Felixes with the SMG and five raids will give you 8K XP. And this is the mission that we're very dedicated to for leveling up fast and it gives you 10k money kill 25 players will give you 6k experience and 3k money killing five players without dying three times will give you 4k experience and then 1k money and usually the last one is optional because i'm usually adding a minty quest but if you want to go full specter missions you can so so you either can go Kill 10 players with the SMG will give you 2K experience and 1K money. Or kill 15 players in five raids will give you 18K experience and 5K money. Now, before I show you my routes, I want to give a shout out to our sponsor today. Hey everyone, calling all content creator, artists, and entrepreneurs. If you're serious about taking your digital gaming to the next level, look no further than our sponsor, Beacon AI. Not only Beacon AI offers customization folios, but if you got a solid following base, they got you covered with a media kit, price calculator to attract the right brands. And guess what? They even got an AI brand reach out and email marketing build right in. Personally, I use Beacon AI to showcase all my channels, websites, and not just that, also show all my referrals for all my VR games. But what I really like about Beacon AI, you can customize your page any way you want, but if you guys are interested, I do have a link in the bio. But other than that, let's get back to the video. Uh, one thing I forgot to mention, you are gonna be in here for a while. So you wanna make sure you have food, a lot of heals, and you're gonna need a lot of ammo. If you plan on knocking out 25 scavs in one raid, you're gonna need it. But other than that, let's go back in. I'll show you what I'm talking about. All right, you spawn in here. You got scavs just chilling. Oh my gosh. Hey, bruh. Blank. It goes one. Oh, oh that's what I say. We got two. Downstairs. Three. Four. Where's he at? He's probably on the steps. I wouldn't be running around like this though if I was uh if it was a live game. 
I got four. But the, the case is you only need a total of five scavs each raid. But we're trying to get you... We're trying to get you all 25 in one raid here. There should be two scavs inside graveyard. We're going to knock these two down over here. By the time we kill these guys and go over there, these guys are going to be back up. But I promise you, you probably finish this to the last... I usually stay into the last five minutes, but this map is not the case. All right, that's five right there. And now the church, the church has a total of three scabs that spawn in here now, so that's freaking nice. I'm gonna go in here. There's always one scab patrolling back here. Yep, there he goes right there. Six, seven. Oh, what? Eight. And then you always can open up your mission menu to see how many you got, but it's not going to show in training. Uh, I'm, that's why I'm counting them. We got nine. They spawn over here rapidly, though. Like, pay attention. Oh, man. This side here, you will get jumped by some scabs, bro. Uh, this video is going to be a little bit long on this portion just so I can give you guys uh, intake on where all the scavs are and you kind of get the gif. What the fuck? That boy is an eater. What was that? I forgot count. It was a 10, 10, 11. All right, that's 11. Should have been a scav, two scavs over here, but it's all right. All right, you see we already made a round already. It's pretty much doing the same thing, bro, till you get 25. It is hella possible to get all 25 here. Because just how fast these guys respawn every time. I should have brought some more. That was 12. Should have brought some more uh, energy chews. By the way, use code META. Use code META on your one-shot energies. So we made a roundabouts again, back around here. Like this guy. 13. And we're back to our building here. We got 13 scavs already going around the whole map. So I'm about to repeat that again. And I'll have 25. So you know, remember our first quest? Kill 12. That one's done. We probably already killed like a total of five players already. I would also take it slow. Just because you see me rushing like this, I would not be going as fast as I am. Because there's players you got to worry about. Like that's their main focus. If you get the players out of the way, the map is yours, bro. Don't be hiding from this, bro. Oh. A 19. You guys get the gif, all right? We're just gonna uh, give you guys, just make a roundabout. Make sure you take it slow when it comes to the players. And that's pretty much it. This MPX is what I ran literally for maybe two, roughly a week, like three days at most. You can easily get this shit done so fast, man. Now to get your spending up, if you wanna be cheap like me this wipe, I would just take every gun, every attachment possible and sell it to Spectre. But if you want to get it done fast and you have the money for it, I recommend to just buy the most expensive guns that you think you're going to use and it will get you up there in no time. If this guy has been helpful, please consider it liking, subscribing and joining my daily streams, except for Sunday. I might be streaming right now, so go check it out. If you enjoyed this video, you won't be disappointed on how to level up Jaren so you can get those AP rounds. But other than that, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.